Olá! O preview chegou e começa dando asas à imaginação. Em 2006, a Disney criou a animação Carros. Mas literalmente, acima desse mundo, existe muito mais coisas para a gente ver. Com vocês, o longa Aviões. Dusty é o protagonista dessa aventura. Ele trabalha pulverizando plantações, mas quer mudar de vida. Seu sotaque tem a assinatura de Dan Cook. He's just kind of like a small town kid, so to speak. You know, he's uh, working on the fields. Uh, he's out there, uh, you know, doing kind of his daily grind. But he has a bigger dream for himself. Dusty, you're not built to race. You're built to dust crops. Do you know what will happen if you push it too far? Turbine <gasps> failure. Turbine oh failure? no, I'm going down. <gasps> Why didn't I listen to Dotty? <laughs> It's about the choice of do you have the guts to go out and follow that dream or do you let your fears stand in your way? Oh, that farmer's gonna race? <laughs> Seriously, with a prop that small? <laughs> of course, when you're recording a voice like this, you have to use a lot of energy. You can't use ordinary kind of speech. You have to project it much more and exaggerate it more. But I thought it was some terrific performances. He's the indoor racing champion of all Mexico. Indoor racing? <laughs> And numero uno recording artist, telenovela star, and romance novelist. Did you say El Chupa Cabra or El Cuckoo Cabra? <laughs> There was a lot of great moments working with this amazing cast of comedians. Uh, whether it was Dane or Julia Louis Dreyfus or Sinbad or Gabriel Iglesias, and and through the process of working with uh, with what we had written on the script, and then actually going into the scene and starting to shoot it, there was a lot of improv that came up. When you give a comedian material and then what they can do to help elevate that scene is amazing. You're going to see a great family film, action comedy. Nobody's going to feel left out. We will have many adventures, you and I. We will laugh, we will cry, we will dance. Um, wow. Probably not with each other. A lot of the research that we did um, just was going and looking, walking around physical airplanes. A uh, lot of study online with real blueprints make sure that we got all the, the parts correct, all the, uh, the flaps were in the right place, the, the everything looked like it worked. It all became cool and real. Oh, you hear that? I'm unbelievable. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Vin Diesel está de volta ao papel do mortífero anti-herói que consegue enxergar no escuro. A ação Hiddick chega para fechar a trilogia do personagem. You go in the first five seconds. Hold him down. Final de partida, amigo. Esse não é qualquer papel para Vin Diesel. O primeiro filme da franquia, no ano 2000, foi sua estreia como protagonista. O que está acontecendo? Por essa razão, sempre vai haver alguma conexão especial. Eu me apaixonei com o papel no papel, um papel tão bem executado, um papel tão bem executado, e um verdadeiro anti-hero. Ultimamente, foi os fãs da franquia que me mantiveram tão leal a so ele. Havia pessoas no Facebook dizendo Every one of us gave you ten dollars. You could go make the movie yourself. You had to make this movie. And comments like that made me feel like I had to make it at all costs. Grant any last wishes? I was referring to you. I'm not gonna straddle you in front of all these good guys. What if I killed all of them first? The real reason why Riddick is on this planet is because he is searching for home and realizes that his stay as a necromonger king can end well. Do you remember where? The Riddick universe is so far afield, so far stretched, there is no true police force. So they filled in with these paramilitary types, these mercenaries, right? Who then have to go and corral the uh, various escape convicts And there's none more famous in the Riddick universe than Riddick, right? And there is nobody with a greater bounty on his head than Riddick. So he is the prize of prizes. And so that's why we have this endless stream of mercenaries on this guy's tail. You're not afraid of the dark, are you? Tudo que é bom dura pouco. O preview chegou ao fim. Mas fica ligado no Telecine que a gente se encontra de novo.